Good morning, good morning. My name is Silvia and this is Rasta. Today we go on a road trip to pass roads and you will see things like this. It was a hard day yesterday because uh, we went to the vet, to the vet, vet doctor, to the to the animal doctor, and uh, we found out uh, Rust had a problem with his left leg behind, and uh, now he has a Kreuzbandriss, and I'm so sorry, but it is so complicated in English that I can't speak it in English, but. Um, uh, it has to do with the, the little thing between his bones on the left leg and this is broken or almost broken. So that means we have to change our life. Yeah. I was crying the whole night because uh, yeah, I want to see my, my dog running free, you know. But then I need to say to myself, Focus on the good. I can't speak all the times that focus on the good and focus on the good. And um, I do not focus on the good when, when I'm in a, in a crisis. You know what I mean? Uh, so, so after this, this uh, after this, this night. Uh, in which I was crying the whole, the whole hours, um, I decided to find solutions. Yeah, the best solutions for Rasta. So in the first, in the first step it is, we have probably, uh, how you say, sur surgery? Surgery? Surgery. Um, and after this he needs to be calm for a few weeks. So the first week without anything, only peeing outside but at least peeing he loves peeing you know that and um, yeah then slowly step by step so yeah but I know my dog he will become crazy when he can't go out so I decided to um, to do some road trips with him because he loves car rides so he don't have to um, stand on his leg. He just can still uh, chill, still chill, <laughs> chill behind in the car, and uh, maybe enjoying the view. Yeah, and uh, we we have many um, road trips in Switzerland, like the Grand Tour, and I decided um, that we will do some some parts of the Grand Tour. Oder? I think it's it's not the worst worst solution for this, and um, then I recognize that we have to um, avoid the places um, on which he loved to run like crazy, because when he go to these places, then he reminds, uh, he remembers, and then think, ah, we run now. And this is a bad thing, so we need to find new um, paths so that he don't go crazy yeah, when he see it, when he go outside. Yeah, there are so many thoughts in my head. Um, yeah, but it, it will come good. Huh? Focus on the good. So today is the first day after this um, doctor visit. So... Um, and I saw that the Grimsel Pass is open. The pass roads are... Not all the pass roads are open, but some of the pass roads are open. And one of... One of these is the Grimsel Pass. Ooh, bumpy. Ooh, very bumpy. Oops. So, 
Uh, one of those pass roads is the Grimsler Pass and this is open. Also open is Furka Pass. So I think we will do both today. Huh? Yeah, yeah. It's early, it's 7.30. But the first motorcycle is already on the road. Um, so we probably have a good time. Huh? I'm probably not that funny as always because of, of this story. But you know me already. I am, I am how I am, well, and not all days are made for laughing, but all days are always to think about, to focus on the good. Owl. So we enjoy this road trip to Grimsel. I tell you a little bit about uh, villages and what you can see here in this area and uh, Rasta is chilling in the car he's okay he's fine he don't understand why mom is all <laughs> all the all crying all the times but uh, it will be better I'm so emotional I'm so sorry yeah people always think that I'm the strongest woman ever but <laughs> I'm so emotional. Yeah, it's okay. I can't hide it, you know. Cause it's okay. So I think the the pass road opened today. I'm quite sure. Ah. I was searching for the lightning, but uh, the cars coming from above take the other road. I'm fine with that. <laughs> yeah, so. And I also decided to, to try to show what you can do with a dog after an, uh, an operation after surgery um, at home so we try to do some s sniff games that he can sniff some things in the in the flat yeah stuff like this that he he must think something yeah yeah this is part of our lives you know Slavish Kamponihov Life is not a pony farm. Do you say that? Did it this in English? It's not a pony farm. We say this in Swiss German. Yeah, life is not a pony farm. That means it's not. Uh, sometimes you can't choose. It's not always. You know. But I also know from my life that the, the worst, ex worst experiences, um, after the worst experiences, something good came out of it. Yeah, but first you have to go through, unfortunately. Yeah. But imagine it would be Ponyhof all the time, huh? That would be maybe boring. You maybe wouldn't recognize how how positive the positive moments are. Hmm? <laughs> no, this is you know at the moment when something bad happens, you 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 do not understand why. Other agree. You do not understand why me, why the dog, why about. But then after after some time, you understand why. I always think that there is a big plan, you know. Big plan guiding me to somewhere. And this is maybe because you know Rasta is such a um, active dog. He's. Uh, 
he's sometimes too active, he's you know, and maybe he needs to learn to slow down a little bit. He's eight and a half and he, he acts still like a two years old dog. So maybe this is a lesson for him. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. We don't know it. We are now in Guttanen. We have 12 degrees outside. I'm so tired oh, because I was thinking and, and crying the whole night. Sometimes we think too much. Sometimes I want to be a dog. They don't think for the next five minutes. It's just the next five minutes or maybe the minute at the moment and then and there is a car behind me. I don't want to have a chaser in the morning. Hop, hu. Go for it. Yeah. Good boy. <laughs> so. I am not in a hurry today. I just want to have a chilly road trip. All the nice meadows. Huh? I don't know if the Gelmerbahn is open. There is a. It's not. It's a. It's not a funicular. It's it's a Standseilbahn. I don't know the word in English. Um, it's very steep. It's. I don't know how many uh, degree. Uh, not degrees. Prozent person of steepness it is but it's very steep when you look down when you are in the train itself it's like you are on a on a senkrecht vertical waagrecht vertical 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 wall it's crazy it's called Gelmerbahn if you want to google uh, I do a, a, a link up here so we find surely the video for this yeah it's a tourist magnet and if you want to do it the game of barn if you want to do the ride you need to do a reservation yeah in advance Otherwise, you won't get a place there. Or maybe it, it opens in June. I don't know. Yeah, just Google Gilmerbahn. G-E-L-M-E-R. opens tomorrow or today ah today but we do not go because you know the problem we have yeah I am um, yeah I also should check about some trips I already planned um, with some trains uh, some trips I can only do with my partner because on some trips we, we need to pull him um, into some some a train or something like this. Pull Rasta. Yeah. Yeah, it's not that easy, Gal. Or you know, I will I will do different different things. Some trips I will do by myself. Yeah, maybe some hikes. And uh, then I will come back home, and then I do something with Rasta, and I do some road trips, and you know, so a little bit diverse, huh? Yeah. Because I, I can't let him uh, be at home the whole the whole time, 24 hours, no way. 
that wouldn't be fair, I think. And he wouldn't understand it. Did you know that in the winter, normally the, the pass road is closed? until this place yeah after here it's only snow and you can book a hotel room at the Grimsel Hospiz yeah then the postal car brings you to this place and then it brings you um, a, a cable car brings you up and then you take another cable car and then you're up there yeah. It's a very nice experience. We were there once with Rasta, but now dogs are not allowed anymore in winter because the, they say the cable car is too small and there are many people in there and when you have a big dog then nobody feels comfortable and the dog doesn't feel comfortable. And now at the next corner there is the parking place of Gamer Barn. shortly check it for you if you want so this is now the life of Rasta for the next probably three months no jumping into creeks not creeks creeks no jumping up to stones no running around in meadows only on the leash for a few minutes yeah but Rasta we will have fun okay I promise you. You still love me? Yeah, yeah. Okay, come on. <laughs> I told you about the percent of steepness of the Gelmerbahn. It's 106. Yeah, that's very steep. So this is now the Gelmerbahn. Yeah, look at that. Very nice little hut. It's closed. They open at 9, I think. And now, you can see it. Ooh, yeah. This is really, really, really steep. Huh? Would you dare? Would you? Look at my small eyes, Swissies. Yeah, this is why I cried the whole night. Because I'm so emotional. And I would love to go to this bridge with Rasta. But he has to wait. Yeah, so I go by myself, okay? <laughs> yeah, would you dare to do this on this bridge? Now you say yes, but now... You still say yes? We couldn't see the train because they are not running yet, but... This is how it would look like, huh? Yeah, maybe with more afraid faces. <laughs> there is also a hotel here, Natur Resort Handbeck. I've never been there, but uh, yeah, I'm sure it's nice. Ooh, I guess we go into moody weather, my dear Swissies. But moody weather at Grimsel Pass is very nice. Yeah, you will love it. This is a very special area with very special stones in the rocks.
so nice to be able to drive on the Alp roads again. We hate to wait such a long time. And because it's early in the morning, there are not yet so many bikers and motorcyclists and cars. So it's quite relaxing. in the fog but the fog can be very nice <laughs> we had to pee only this um, altitude the fog and maybe at Grimsel we are above the fog sometimes it's, it's just a few meters you know we will see they produce a lot of energy here Valley. Many Staus here. I always forget the word Staus here in English. But you know what I mean. The lakes from which they get energy. Yeah, if we could see something, we would see the Hospiz, but we, I drive with you there. So, is it already here? I think so. No, or maybe the next. No, it's another one. It's another one, not a curve. We need to go. And then I'll show you shortly to the Hospiz, from which I was telling you before, where you can go up in winter with the cable car where dogs aren't allowed anymore, remember? Yeah. They have very, very nice fruit pies. Tvačkavaya. <laughs> Can you say this in English? Tvačkavaya. I think it's okay for me to go there. Aplikosavaya. <laughs> Vaya is a pie. Or a kind of pie in Swiss German. I love Vaya. It's not the same like Vehe. Well, there are Vaya and Vehe. Vehe. And Vehe is when you get your child. <laughs> then, uh, yeah, don't ask for Vehe when you are in a bakery. <laughs> they will laugh at you, okay? I had to adjust the focus because of the, the fog. So, why, so that's why it is dark in the tunnel and we have a good light now. slowly arrives here I don't know exactly how high it is right now we will see it later there are always sign spots on the on 
the highest peaks on the Alp Road. Oh, I would love to let Rustle playing in the snow, but he's not allowed. see something it would be a very nice area <laughs> but yeah we will try it too at Furka Pass we have enough time and so Rasta is a little bit entertained yeah baby huh yeah he's looking out of the window right now this makes him tired too Rasta, you see the snow? Yeah. For once, only from, from far away. Yeah? Or maybe we can take a sniff later. You see the Grimsel? No, you don't see it. <laughs> Grimsel was beats would be here on the right. And I drive a little bit. You can drive to the Hush Beats. There are some parking places there. And maybe when we are really, really close, we can see it. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, also interesting. It's driving to nowhere. There is not a lot to see today, yeah? Not enough, a lot. Ooh, that's foggy too. You can stay here too in summer, right? It's not only open in winter. It's mostly open in summer. So this is the hospice. I just turned a little bit. So. And voila. Huh? This is how it looks like. It seems close. Huh? I don't think that we get the way here today. <laughs> okay, maybe next time. Maybe next time. Sorry for the bumpy recording. kind of situation. So, now we go back to nowhere.
Rasta, you see something when you look outside. Is that piece? Not really. Maybe the snow, huh? There is a lake around. Ooh, I see some blue sky. Ooh, maybe we are lucky and we are above the fog soon. That would be nice. Ah, look at it. You see on the right? Look. Wow, crazy. Crazy, Yoda? It's a lake. change the gimbal just a minute yeah they are awake now so back on the road again hoping for blue sky Lucky. Ooh, that would be nice. Huh? I think the wait was worth it. Or the watch. Oh! Yay! Yeah, so cool. Yeah, as I said, we are. Oh, it's it's only a few meters and oh I have to stop. I have to stop somewhere. Let me stop, please. Ah, I can stop here. Now I show you something. Hold on, hold on. Ooh. <laughs> oh look at all. How nice. I take you with me just a minute. Oh dear Swissies. Look at this. I hoped that we will have something like this, but I didn't know it. Whoa. Crazy schön, huh? And now you can see the Grimsel Hochspitz. Yeah, we were there a few minutes ago, remember? Ooh. And now all the motorcyclists are coming. Boy, that was crazy nice, oder? Huh? Oh, I'm so happy that I could show you this. Runter eine von rechts. Oh, yeah, it's coming up. Someone from the right. No, it's okay. It's okay. So, soon we are at the peak of the Grimsel Pass. Ah, I guess it's on 2000. I don't know, 180. <laughs> I don't know it. It's maybe more, but we see it in a few seconds. How high it is. It's again cloudy over there. Was this the moment for today? We will see. Shall we go to Furka Pass? Huh? Yes or no? Thumbs up? Thumbs down. Ah, uh, here it's not open yet, but here you can go on the right, and there is a ah 2165. I'm not so bad. I'm not so bad. Here I just go a little bit on the right. Here soon the road is open, and then you can drive up the road to certain times. And uh, there is a, a, another lake and another Berkosthaus mountain hotel. 
very nice and a uh, lot of animals, a lot of uh, nice mountain plants. Yeah, but it's not open now. I think they, it's still winter over there. Well, look at this. It's, it's still winter here. Huh? Ooh, yeah, look at the wall. You can see now the dudes and the wall. You see how much snow there is. Yeah, all the motorcyclists coming up, having a coffee. And I think one day we will stay here overnight. I think they renovated the, the rooms and I think that's uh, very nice here. I stop shortly to show you this lake here around the corner. The lake is still covered with some ice. Uh, it's about five degrees now, I think. Yeah, I stayed once in this mountain hotel over there. It was quite okay. I'm hungry a little bit, so we try to search for some kiosk. <laughs> How are kiosk called in English? Kiosk. Something you can just buy some chewing gums and some drinks and some sandwiches. Maybe here, huh? We got a gipfeli at the restaurant up there. And now we drive to Furkapas. Is that okay for you? Hmm? We are not alone anymore. <laughs> Look, you already can see it. Yeah. Impressive Furkapas. With the James Bond location. Hmm? How is the hotel called over there? I don't know. There's a famous picture with James Bond and his car, Aston Martin or something like this. Yeah. Belvedere or so. Is it Belvedere? We will see. We will see. We have nice moods right now. Huh? We drive now down to the villi oh, village. It's not the village. I think it's the three hotels, <laughs> and it's called Gletch. I still have my winter tires on. I need to change next week. But I'm always late with changing to summer tires because I love to drive on pass roads. And on pass roads sometimes, and also sometimes at this time of the year, it could be frozen in the early morning. So then it's better to have some winter tires on or sometimes it's also snowing you never know yeah there is not a lot of snow left huh? so you clearly can see Will be probably the worst years for the glaciers ever with weather like this less snow in winter too hot temperatures in spring yeah
curvy, huh? A really curvy road. I think this is also a, a part of the Grand Tour. Grimslfurka. And then the other one, I forgot the name. Overall, club. Yeah, I think this is all Grand Tour stuff. And I think during the time that uh, Rasta is not able to, to run a lot or to walk a lot, we will do some parts of the Grand Tour. High summer when we can see some animals on the roads. Yeah, that that will be funny, huh? Yeah. yeah. We take the best out of the situation, as we always try to do. It's not always possible, <laughs> but not. Or maybe not in every little moment, but I think at the end you should focus on the good. Oh, nice Oh, look at the stimmig date. The nice clouds over there. Wow. Oh, I want to be there right now. Come on, let's go. So good. Huh? So this is Glitch now. Yeah. Very small village. It was very famous because once the glacier over there, <laughs> where you can see stones, came until this place. Imagine. Yeah. But now it looks like a lost place, a little bit. Yeah, came the whole way down the glacier. Don't till here. Crazy, isn't it? Yeah, so is this. Life is a permanent changing. Nothing will last forever. That's why we have to seize the moment. Ah. Yeah. This is what dogs do, that's why they have a Grüßbandriss then. <laughs> because they they run around too fast. Yeah. That would be a nice picture now with the hotel over there. But I cannot stop. Oh, the Stimmigrad. Mm, the mood. Whew. You are so lucky again, dear Swissies, to see this. Huh? Oh, I have a chaser. It's Sunday. Awesome. It's not a real Sunday. It's a. Uh, it's a what, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. It's a Thursday, Sunday. <laughs> yeah. But even on a Thursday, Sunday, people are in a hurry. I don't know why. <gasps> Enjoy it. Enjoy it, Swissies. Look them all. Ay, 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 ay. Huh? Was oh, das schön. So now you can do it. Do it, baby. Do it. You can do it. Come. Go, go for it. Yeah. You are welcome. <laughs> ah. Now, after two or three curves, take a look. Take a look, dear Swissies. <laughs> it looks so surreal again. 
Huh? Uh, Mother Nature made me smile. Makes me smile again. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Crazy shoe. I stop here for for a picture. That would be maybe nice. Okay, picture im Hoste. Let's go again. Before the mood is gone. Rasta, is it okay for you? Yeah, yeah. You can watch the snow melting. <laughs> yeah, sorry, baby. Crazy nice. Love it? I do. I think that was a good idea to go on these past roads. Huh? I don't think that we go the whole way to the full compass. Maybe we go back later when we are at the, at the hotel over there. We will see. We will see. It's so difficult for me to not stop and, and to let the rust run around. It's difficult for me. It's maybe difficult, more difficult for me than for Rasta. The whole situation. Because dogs live in the moment. Yeah. Well, maybe. When the pass roads are open, this is a happening for everyone. For campers, for motorcyclists, for bikers, for everyone. Because it's such a cool experience. forget it's very dangerous too huh? you have to ex expect everything in summer 
also animals. You see the hotel over there? I think it's, it's Belvedere. I think so. But I cannot remember the, the name of the movie. I need to check. Wow. I think they... They were driving very fast here, huh? survived <laughs> and the stones and the, this is hotel beaver there the stones behind and over there is the, is the glacier and they prepare a little bit of the glacier every year, but I do not recommend. Yeah, better than I do not recommend it. It's it's only a tourist thing and it's too expensive. Yeah, it's too expensive to see nothing. Oh, there are already so many people here. Yeah, it's a place to be here yeah, today. <laughs> yeah, I think we're gonna have a drink here, huh? So it was the movie, the James Bond movie, Goldfinger. Yeah. Where James Bond was here with his Aston Martin or something like this. Yeah, was here. Exactly at this place. Unfortunately, the hotel is closed since many, many years. Yeah, it's short. I would love to see it open. Hmm. All right, we go shortly to the other side of the pass, of the Furka Pass, because this is not the peak yet. We check out the peak and then we go back. Huh? Rasta, maybe you see some snow again. All right. There's still some snow over there. Whoa, the clouds. So nice. Looks fantastic. Huh? Don't forget to keep your eyes on the road when you see <laughs> when you see the amazing landscape of Switzerland. Okay? The Susten Pass is not open yet because otherwise we we could have go could have go what in English um, we could have done <laughs> we could have done uh, Susten Pass and going back again to Venice Oberland but Susten Pass is closed so that's why we we turn when we are on the peak I guess. Or maybe when we have crazy moods, we go further, but we will see it, huh? We will see it. Did I say that it was the movie Goldfinger? I don't think so, huh? What's the movie Goldfinger? James Bond? Goldfinger, yeah. I don't know how many times James Bond was here to record something. At least two times, because once on Shilton with the revolving restaurant, and uh, one Bond movie was was uh, recorded here on this road. Well, a part of it. Yeah, I need to do some research. I think this is the 
peak now. How high you guess? I think it's 2,250. <laughs> it's a guess. It's written somewhere. Not here. Ah, da. It's 2,436. Little bit than Abbott. Huh? But it's a little bit higher than Greensland. Huh? I think we stop here again with Rasta and then we go back. Agree? We found some snow for Rasta. At least he can eat some. Cal? Yeah, but not playing, baby. Cal, no, only eating. No, Nesta, mm -mm. I know it's hard for you. Cal? So, we turn now back into the direction of Furka Pass, then back again to Grimsel Pass. Yeah, and then we are home again. Yeah, it's really special to have Rasta always on the leash. Uh, but we can't change it. It's better for him. Huh? Hop, hop, Kinder, Kinder. Hop, hop. Maybe we have some great moods again. <clears throat> we have some really cool clouds and some sir clouds up there. Yeah, you see, this is the sign of the Grand Tour over there on the left. Imagine the, the work is behind when they have to clean the road. Hmm? Cleaning from the stones, cleaning from the snow, from everything. It's a lot of work. So I say thank you for cleaning the road. So that we can drive on it.
now we see the Hotel Belvedere again. From the other side, you see this should be the the, <laughs> the glacier, but it it doesn't look like this. I swear. Yeah, it does look worse. So I have a chaser. I leave it pass. Home, Kastora. Go for it. So. Yeah, the longer the days, the more people are on the road, of course. Now we have uh, half past ten. We have seven degrees. Hey, sportivo, sportivo, huh? was all glacier. You see the stones and the, the border? That was all glacier. You can see clearly now. You can sing now. I can see clearly now the glacier's gone. <laughs> Yeah, it's not funny, I know, but sometimes we need to do jokes about things. Yeah. The snapper satire. Satire. Not satire. Satire species or something to eat. Satire. I hope it's called like this in English. Satire. Satire. it when many bikes motorcycles are on the road you know like 20 motorcycles in a row oh I love that but they are not here yet I think they they plan to be on a in a restaurant at uh, lunchtime so it's probably too early now it's 20 to 10 
also a lot of people coming from Germany because in Germany they don't have I think so they don't have roads like this or not many roads like this because Germany is quite flat <laughs> yeah They have also a train, I don't know, I think it's a steam train too, going up to Furka, the Furka train. Yeah, Google. It's over and expensive. It's really, really expensive. But I think it, it's probably a nice, a nice steam train ride. Not that nice as with Brian's Rothorn train, because there you have this amazing lake but I'm quite sure it is nice too oh still tired yeah keep on smiling <laughs> sure if they have an old-timer race here on this pass road somewhere they have an old-timer race but I'm not sure if it's Furka or maybe Gotthard I think it's Gotthard Google <laughs> Google old-timer race Switzerland and you will find it for sure same nice mood than before we had really really nice it's nice it's nice okay but it was nicer before huh? but anyway it is very impressive and more impressive when you know that all this what you see now with stones was once a glacier into the valley so sorry yeah it's time time to go to bed it's almost 10 <laughs> uh, yeah I, I, I came out a little bit of my daily routine because of effects with Rasta Headache, migraine, yeah, all in one. But you know, sometimes it's better to do something else than always to think about the same thing. Oblanche. Sometimes this is the best you can do. Mm. I think we go again for a little walk with Rasta. Hmm? On the leash. Quite boring. It is again a little bit of Rasta time. I had one leash, yeah, in my Schublade, a longer one. So he is still under control, but he is on the leash. Gal, it's not that bad. It's a little bit of, of freedom. Huh, baby? Huh? It's 
It's not that bad, Rasta, oder? Ha? Huh? What you think? Ja, ja. Aber nicht hier, du. Yeah, we have to learn to keep him calm. Ja, schön slowly. Slowly. Come on, Yeah, it's unusual for all of us, but it's the best thing for us, though, you know? Yeah. Come, watch the over Yeah, good boy. And I think he looks happy. Not that happy without leash, but he's still happy. Rasta is happy. Ja, okay. So that was the first trip, or it still is first trip with uh, stop and go and walking a little bit with Rasta on the leash. I think it's a good solution to have this, this long leash. So uh, he's under control but he still can walk a little bit f away from me. Gives him maybe a little bit of freedom. <laughs> yeah. did not um, seem frustrated. I think he, he can handle this, huh? And now I need to handle it and then <laughs> and then everything is okay. Yeah. It makes me wonder if it is still so foggy on the other side of uh, Grimsel. We will see it soon. some city trips in this time when Rasta is not able to hike a lot so he can stay at home with my partner and I can do some city trips so you see something else yeah we take the best out of it huh yeah yeah we are warriors <laughs> is not the thing that yeah of course that he has something that something is wrong with him but I cannot explain to him you know when you have a child and you can talk to him so you can explain listen it's like this and this and this not that the child will understand it but at least you, you explained but a dog you cannot explain something to a dog it's just so this is the most important thing that I give him a, a, a good feeling all the time. Well. 
Ja. Gell, Bubbeli? Ja, ja. And thanks for listening. This is my, my kind of therapy. <laughs> yeah. You know, when something is in your mind, some, or something bad happened, or... Yeah, it's a good thing to talk about it. Yeah, to let it out. This really is the best you can do. We saw once uh, an accident um, with uh, one dead person, a very young person, I think the person was 17 or something like this, or 20. And uh, yeah, he just died in front of us. Yeah, we were not involved, but we saw it. And uh, then you are in shock, you know. And the best you can do is talking about what happened. The worst thing you can do is just thinking for yourself. This is the worst thing. So what I did today is therapy. <laughs> yeah. So thanks for watching. <laughs> thanks for the therapy. And yeah, and if you have any tips, doesn't matter for the dog or for for a, a life tip, just comment, just write it in the comment. I'm sure there are many people outside in this world with a lot of experiences who could tell a lot of their experiences to us, to other people. Yeah. So if you have a, a life tip, write it. Ah, oh, now the motorcyclists are everywhere. Huh? Yeah, they are on the road now. We are back again at Grimsel Pass, where we came from. The fog is gone. Yeah, it's good. So we have two different videos. Huh? One with fog. <laughs> and one with nice weather. Already so many people here and it's getting worse. Yeah. Ooh, still foggy over there. Huh? Wow, look the side motorcyclists. <laughs> so many. Crazy. Yeah. I think we go into the fog again. But looks nice, huh? A sea of fog. It looks amazing. We drive directly into the fog now. <laughs> yeah, they do, of course, all their selfies there. <laughs> I did the same. Well, not the selfie, but I took a picture with Rasta. Yeah, a very nice one. I think we will focus on pictures again until he's able to run again in the fields. Huh? Oh, 
I hope you like Rasta pictures. Huh? I have. And sometimes I I upload an old one. Yeah. One, two, three, and we're in. One, two, three. And after this, I, I think I, I will stop recording now because we already know this, brother. So I hope you enjoyed. And if you have a live tip, write it in the comments. Or if you want to write anyway something, yeah, let it out. Thank you and see you in the next video. Bye bye.